I can't, you know, I never can't say never. You know, I got to try. You know what I mean? A neighbor who helped save a teenager from a fiery crash is being hailed as a hero. Good evening, Don is off tonight. An 18 year old suffered a serious head injury in that crash. News Force Callan Gray talked to that Good Samaritan tonight. Callan? Dave Jackie, neighbors on Cape and Boulevard say if Howard Williams wasn't standing in his driveway at the moment this young man crashed, this story would be much different. Williams tells us he hopes anyone would do this if they were faced with the same situation. Howard Williams didn't hesitate when a young driver hit a tree on his street late Sunday night and the SUV burst into flames. So I ran over there to say, yo, hello, is anybody all right? Are you okay? He says he tried to pry the door open to save the driver, but it was locked. So he used a fire extinguisher to put out the fire under the hood. Fire, it, like, it's tried to, it looked like it was finding some other way to start, to start dripping gas, whatever it was leaking. So it started meaning going towards the back of the car. And that's when everybody, when some of the neighbors came, I was like, man, he leave it alone. You can't get it open. I don't know. But Williams kept going, eventually breaking the window open with the fire extinguisher. I opened it, pulled him to the side and dragged him out to safety, to, just in case the car was going to blow. We heard he's got a pulse. Neighbors like Cheryl Mullen call Williams a hero. And he went right into mode. He literally saved this kid's life. This, this car was inflamed. Amherst police say the 18-year-old driver was taken to ECMC with a serious head injury. We pray for the young man and, you know, a speedy recovery. And she says if it weren't for Williams, this young man wouldn't have a chance. She calls it an Easter miracle that Williams was outside when the crash happened. I believe it was uh, because, you know, if he wasn't out here talking to his daughter, he would have been in the house. That car would have been engulfed. Do you feel like a hero? Uh, yeah, in a way, but, you know, hey, I do what I have to do. I, I imagine if that was me or somebody else in my family, I wanted somebody to come help or try to help. Williams is part of the organization Buffalo Police Reserves and says he has been trained to deal with emergency situations. The Eggertsville Hose Company tells us they put out the fire once they got on scene. This crash is still under investigation. Amherst Police did not have an update for us tonight on the driver's condition, but we expect to hear more tomorrow. Reporting in the studio, Callan Gray, News 4.